Welcome to my YouTube channel, fellow travelers. I'm Navdeep, and today we're embarking on an exciting journey through the captivating land of Egypt, a land where the echoes of pharaohs whisper on the desert winds, where colossal monuments stand as testaments to a glorious past, and where the very sands hold the secrets of civilizations long gone. Let's dive into the cinematic beauty of Egypt, where ancient wonders meet modern marvels. Here, on the outskirts of modern-day Cairo, we find ourselves dwarfed by the Great Pyramids of Giza. Built by pharaohs Khufu, Khafre, and Menkora, these tombs showcase ancient Egyptian ingenuity. Imagine workers pulling massive stone blocks, driven by their pharaoh's will. The scale of these structures is awe-inspiring. The Great Pyramid of Khufu was the tallest man-made structure for over 3,800 years. The Sphinx, with its lion's body and human head, has guarded these pyramids for centuries. The setting sun casts long shadows, painting the pyramids in hues of gold and crimson. It's a scene of breathtaking beauty, a final farewell to these timeless wonders. Leaving behind the desert sands, we journey now to the shores of the Red Sea, to a paradise known as Masa Alam. Here, the turquoise waters hold a different kind of ancient wonder, a vibrant underwater world teeming with life. As we slip beneath the waves, a kaleidoscope of colors greets us. Schools of fish, a dazzling array of shapes and sizes, dart in and out of coral reefs. These reefs, a city beneath the waves, are home to a staggering diversity of marine life. Delicate sea fans sway gently in the current, while brightly colored fish, adorned with stripes and spots, flit through the coral branches. It's a delicate dance of life, an underwater ballet that plays out on these submerged stages. And then, a shadow passes overhead. A graceful manta ray, its wing-like fins propelling it effortlessly through the water. It glides past, a majestic giant, reminding us of the sheer scale and power of the ocean's inhabitants. As we venture further out, we encounter the playful spinner dolphins, their sleek bodies twisting and turning as they leap from the water. These intelligent creatures, with their almost permanent smiles, are a joy to behold. Their playful nature, a testament to the sheer joy of life in this underwater paradise. But it's not just the fish that captivate us here. Loggerhead turtles, ancient mariners, glide past, their shells adorned with barnacles, a testament to their long journeys across the ocean. These gentle giants, once hunted for their meat and shells, are now protected, a symbol of hope for the future of our oceans. We travel now to the ancient city of Thebes, known today as Luxor, a place where history whispers from every stone. Here, on the banks of the Nile, the ancient Egyptians built a city of such grandeur that it has captivated the imaginations of travelers and scholars for centuries. Luxor is, in essence, the world's greatest open-air museum. Dominating the skyline is the Karnak Temple Complex, a sprawling monument to faith and pharaohs. It's a city within a city, a complex of temples, chapels and pylons, each one adorned with intricate carvings and hieroglyphics testament to the skill of the ancient Egyptian artisans. As we walk through its massive columns, we are dwarfed by their sheer size, our footsteps echoing through the halls, the only sound disturbing the silence of centuries. Carved into the walls, we see scenes from Egyptian mythology, gods and goddesses locked in eternal struggle, pharaohs offering sacrifices to appease the deities, and tales of everyday life, farming, hunting, and celebrating. These intricate carvings provide a glimpse into the beliefs and values of this ancient civilization, offering us a window into a world long gone. A short distance away lies the Valley of the Kings, a desolate yet awe-inspiring necropolis where pharaohs, including the legendary Tutankhamun, were laid to rest. Hidden within these barren hills are tombs carved deep into the rock. Their walls adorned with vibrant paintings depicting scenes from the afterlife. As we descend into these subterranean chambers, 
we are transported back in time. The air is heavy with the weight of history, the silence broken only by the sound of our own breath. It's a humbling experience, a reminder of our own mortality and the enduring legacy of those who came before us. Our journey takes us further south, to the city of Aswan, a place where the Nile flows serenely between granite cliffs and emerald islands. Aswan, the ancient gateway to Africa, has long been a crossroads of cultures and a vital trading post. It was here that the Nile's life-giving waters were harnessed, allowing the ancient Egyptians to thrive in this otherwise arid land. Dominating the landscape is the Aswan High Dam, a modern-day marvel of engineering that controls the flow of the Nile, providing irrigation and hydroelectric power. While the dam's construction brought about significant changes to the region, it also created Lake Nasser, one of the world's largest man-made lakes, a haven for wildlife and a popular destination for boat trips. But Aswan is more than just its modern marvels. It is a city steeped in history and culture, most notably the Nubian culture. The Nubian people, with their distinctive style of dress, warm hospitality and vibrant music, have inhabited this region for centuries. No trip to Aswan is complete without a visit to Philae Temple, a complex of temples dedicated to the goddess Isis. Originally located on Philae Island, the temple was dismantled and moved to its current location on Agilkia Island to save it from the rising waters of Lake Nasa. As we explore the temple's elegant columns and intricate reliefs, we are reminded of the power of human ingenuity and the importance of preserving our cultural heritage. And then, as the sun begins to set, we board a traditional felucca, a sailboat with a graceful triangular sail, and embark on a serene journey along the Nile. The gentle rocking of the boat, the cool breeze on our faces, and the breathtaking views of the riverbanks create a sense of peace and tranquility. Leaving behind the lush banks of the Nile, we venture into the heart of Egypt's deserts, where otherworldly landscapes await. Here, beneath a vast, star-studded sky, lies a realm of stark beauty, a testament to the raw power of nature. Our first destination is the Black Desert, a surreal landscape sculpted by volcanic activity millions of years ago. As we drive through this alien terrain, we are surrounded by countless black hills, remnants of ancient volcanoes, their slopes littered with volcanic rock and stones. The contrast between the dark hills and the clear blue sky is striking, creating a sense of awe and wonder. But the black desert is not devoid of life. Hardy plants, such as acacia trees and desert grasses, cling tenaciously to life, their roots reaching deep into the parched earth. And, as if to prove that life finds a way even in the harshest of environments, we spot a gazelle, its graceful form a blur of movement as it darts across the desert floor. Our journey then takes us to the White Desert, a place where the landscape transforms once again. Here, under the scorching sun, lies a world of dazzling white, a sea of chalk rock formations sculpted by wind and sand over millennia. These formations, some resembling giant mushrooms, others towering obelisks, create a surreal and unforgettable landscape. As the sun begins to set, casting long shadows across the desert floor, the white rock formations take on a warm, ethereal glow. It's a magical moment, a time when the desert comes alive with color and light. We set up camp under a sky ablaze with stars, the silence broken only by the crackling of our campfire. As the sun sets over the Nile, casting long shadows across the land, we come to the end of our incredible journey through Egypt. From the ancient wonders of the pyramids to the vibrant underwater world of the Red Sea, from the historical treasures of Luxor to the serene beauty of Aswan, Egypt has captivated our senses and left an indelible mark on our souls. Remember to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more travel adventures. Until next time, keep exploring and stay curious.
The world is full of wonders waiting to be discovered.